I'll jump right into it, Director Ray. Uh, recently, uh, I have been apprised of information that is concerning regarding individuals that are encountered at the border who during the process of interviewing in the field, specifically using um, uh, an I-213 form, the match for their ID comes back as inconclusive. That information is then subsequently redacted and listed as derogatory. When members of this committee, as well as other committees, have attempted to get access to this information, it has been denied. Why is this information in these field interviews with these individuals who have then subsequently been found to be suspected uh, on the, the suspected terror watch list, why is that information derogatory and why has the FBI neglected to share that information with Congress? Uh, Congressman, I'm not familiar with the particular redactions in question, so I'm happy to have my staff follow up with you and figure out why there's a disconnect. Uh, certainly, I know we've provided all sorts of information uh, to this committee uh, in a variety of forms, um, and I'm, I'm happy to see what it is that's missing and, and why. Well, and, and I think you have demonstrated a willingness to, to work with this committee and others, so could you commit in the next 30 days to providing the committee staff on Homeland Security all of the unredacted field interviews? Well, what I can commit to you is that I will follow up with my team to find out what the heck is going on, and if there's information that we can provide that, that we haven't, no, no, no. we will. Well, I, no, there, I'm no, not, no information should be redacted, and there can be no good reason. If you can't provide me with a reason why the information is listed as derogatory right now, then you should commit to full transparency to Congress, and that can be in a skiff, that's fine, in a classified setting, but this committee staff should have full access to the field interviews especially as it pertains to individuals that have been apprehended or encountered at the southwest border with ties to terrorist groups. Yes or no? I'm not trying to be obtuse, I promise. I don't, since I'm not familiar with the specific redactions, I would ask to be able to go back with my team and find out why it's redacted and if there's a reason for it Can that you is provide valid, us we will discuss that with you. Days, and if there's not Director a reason, Ray, we will provide you the Director Ray, within 30 days, if you can provide this committee in writing a rationale as to why that information is, is redacted and what classifies it as derogatory, that would be incredibly helpful. We'd be happy to get back to you okay, within perfect. 30 days.